Hello and welcome, Paul here, and I am playing Warsword Conquest, a mod for Mountain Blade Warband, and this is my Chaos Campaign. Now, we have taken Tancred Castle, I don't know where he's going, but we're going to keep an eye on it, make sure no one goes back and captures anything we've taken. Now we're pushing up, we're going to go for our Castle Breg Bress is under a siege, let's go check it. Right, Tancred 2, that isn't... I have 106 people in there, you're telling me that's not enough? Very well. Eliminate this lot. I need to get more food as well, it's not good that we're moving around with such low supplies. We're not going to survive these encounters, I'm going to start having people leave. That wouldn't be good. Pretty sure my horse is also buggered, so I'm gonna have to fix him. We'll let him rest up. Only seven. Yep. My cavalry is finally back to where it once was. My chosen, my knights, they're finally back. Wow. <laughs> that pile up. That was a mega pile up. Very good, we're taking a prisoner, that makes it all worth it. Hopefully that should free up at Tancred Castle. Now, hopefully we can make it back in time. Again, I forgot to switch. Damn. That line of cavalry makes me proud. Makes me very proud. Come on, can we really not catch this guy? Oh my god. It's pathetic.
and he got away. Oh well. As long as no one else goes after this castle. As long as this castle is secure, which I believe it is, we can move on. Although I am out of food, I'm going to go back to Altdorf. I'm just going to change my horse up. Can't help but feel like we're catching up to this guy, so... Let's do it. So I've beaten this guy so many times now, I could be wrong. So we take this, I go back to Altdorf, maybe Marienburg and whatever else. We recruit, we buy supplies, then we go after then we go after Corone. But I have to be careful here, there's a lot of uh, Master Dwarven engineers. <clears throat> Which is very bad. stop them before they can do any real damage. Ooh, I could lock these people up in outdoor. I've got a lot of prisoners currently. Not a bad idea. Recruit and recruit. Marketplace, give me some food. That's the food situation solved. Now onwards to Altdorf. Who's fighting out here? Are oh, they going to escape? In that case, let's continue on. We're going to Corone. We've taken all this, which is good. Vol's anvil was taken. So if I take Corone and we just chop off that side, I'm pretty sure I'm doing the same thing in my Witch Hunter playthrough. At the moment, so... Yeah, why not? Let's do it. Rome will be a big one, although it doesn't have too many people there. Should have just enough prisoners to fill who I'm missing. Unfortunately, there's not much I can do here. We're stuck trying to battle our way up, and all I can do is keep sending troops up on the attack. But that's fine, I suppose.
Come on. This is why I like being the first up because I can get up in and I can organize my troops. That's why I always go up first. But it's a bit too late now. Come on. There was only 130, so this shouldn't take too long. 76 are already dead, and 52 enemies. We're finally pushing up. My troops are spreading out nicely, so yeah. It's going well. I like how people like Felix are basically killing. I mean, he was from the Empire, but the fact that he's just killing fellow humans is just. I don't know. Feels evil. Anyway. Another city has fallen, which is good. Our slow push to take back the lands is going quite well. <clears throat> All I have to do is keep this pressure up, keep taking these places, keep dumping my troops in there to ensure we don't lose them immediately. Soon Britonia will have nowhere to go and they will be eliminated. The funny thing is, is that Britonia is looking to be eliminated both in my Witch Hunter campaign and my Chaos campaign at this roughly the same time. Which, I don't know why, I just find that funny. Anyway. I'm going to dump these people into Koron. Koron is one of the biggest cities that Britonia own. In fact, one of their original cities. We're going to go ahead and make sure we got people up in that place. Don't want to give them a chance. I could have requested they be given to me, but I, I don't really want any more territories. At the moment. So I had 389 troops roughly, so if we take it down below 300 troops, that should be more than enough to defend this place. Although I do wonder if the quality of troop matters at all. Like if it actually helps in deterring people, or if it's just pure numbers. I honestly don't know. I honestly don't know. visit the tavern, make sure there's no one here to recruit. Actually a few people if I wanted them I could. Do I need more though? Don't know. Anyway, Corona has fallen. I don't want to waste time, I want to keep pushing.
this place will be a good one to take. It's going to require a siege tower, it's going to take two days. We'll go ahead and start doing this. Because once we've got this castle, basically all their land is just going bye bye. It is going bye bye. But I think they have uh, enemy forces near Caron, so we will have to go back and defend that. But that will wait until. Ooh, the king's already back and fighting, which is frustrating. Got 15 hours to go. Come on. Come on. Problem with the siege towers is that by the time the tower reaches the castle walls, you know, I don't have any ranged, really, with my current army, so they just gotta take the hits until that siege tower is pushed up. Here we go, and we'll do it in the dead of night. All I can do is wait for this to be pushed up. Why can't I get a shield like that? It looks awesome. Oh, it's the Warlord. Alright, well. Yeah, I would like the Warlord stuff. No, that's the Chosen. Where's the Warlord? There he is. I want his gear. I want his armor. But I tell you what, I am going to have to get back onto Warhammer Online and play it sometime. Such a fun game, maybe I'll have to do that. Create a couple of guilds. One for order, one for chosen. Uh, destruction. We'll see. Anyway, battle rages on. We're close. We are close. Killing the archers. Oh, they're already dead. Basically, we want to just pull our troops. Oh, I don't have that many. Never mind. Downstairs, take them out. Take them out. Oh, they got me stuck.
Come on, keep killing them. Keep killing them. Bring them down. Come on. There's only a few left. Okay, there's more than a few left, but you know. Just annihilate them. Let me go kill their archers. Since we're doing such a good job dealing with their infantry that they're sending after us. And I guess still got more troops that can go. Troops getting stronger and stronger. How many people did they have defending this? I didn't look. Oh, come on, guys, get down here already. Let me try and hit him from behind. Take out as many as I can. Just annihilate them. I'm tired of these special skills that basically keep it alive. It is frustrating. I shouldn't really have them. I should have them, not them. My ally should have them, not them. Job's done though. Job's done. Who's left? Is there anyone else hiding anywhere on the battlements? No, just this last guy. Is it just him left? I don't know, let's find out. Bam. Is that it? Nope, there's still a couple more. Let's go. Let's go. Go, go, go. Raleigh. Oh, of course, this is one last guy who's all the way up here. Hiding there. Oh, and he's still killing our people. Wonderful. Wonderful. There we go. Anyway, that's all for now. Wait, no, it's not. No, it's not. There's a bit more resistance. Let's crush him. Anyone else? Okay. As I was saying, that's all for now. Thank you for watching. Until next time.